Another one, it's June 2nd, second day of June. Second day, I said second day, no, it's the second day of June. You know what I mean? I felt like uh, Brother Man from Martin for a little minute. Brother Man from the fifth floor, you know what I'm saying? But um, here yeah, with the day two vlog, just out, I'm about to head to the doctor real quick, just to, you know, get my little annual checkup, physical, make sure everything good. So I know they're about to draw blood and do all of the extra, extra stuff. So, you know, y'all pray for me today, you know what I mean? Like, I don't really like needles like that, you know what I mean? I could tolerate them, but I just be hating when the doctors don't know what the hell they doing. And when they be drawing blood and you tell them like, yo, bro, this is where all the blood is going to come from that you need. You feel what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? Like, because I don't know, like my veins be playing hide and seek at times. There's some times when they want to work and then there's times when it's just like peekaboo. You feel what I'm saying? So driving right now on the road but just wanted to connect with y'all you know say what's up say what go on what was good hope y'all day blessed y'all hope y'all having a blessed day and um you know i just want to remind you that you are somebody you are special because i said it and you said it and we both believe it so therefore it is so so paying attention because you got a lot of angry drivers and a lot of these people don't know how to drive out here. So I'm going to, you know, link back up with y'all in a sec once I get settled down and once I stop driving. And uh, welcome to day two, y'all. Here we go. What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? So listen, I just came from the doctor's office. Uh, You know, had a little physical. It's all good. I got to go back Monday to do all of the blood work and all of that. I'm not looking forward to that, but I'm glad it didn't happen today. Feel me like I wasn't mentally prepared for the little blood work today, but um, besides to like stop off, I saw this little reservoir that I used to just come to and chill and kick it and get my thoughts. So I was like, let me just come over here, just kind of chill, enjoy nature, get a little vlog. But you know, y'all, y'all see like y'all see this? It says caution. Crazy. But I don't plan on running into any, any of those wildlife because, you know, us as black people, we know we sense danger. <laughs> and when danger's around, we the first ones to get up out of there. You feel me? So, yeah, like, how y'all doing today, man? Like, hope everybody having a blessed day. It's Friday. Listen, sky's the limit. Whatever you want to do in life, I say, look, just get like Nike and just do it. You know what I mean? Like, I'm excited about vlogging for 30 days, y'all. I'm excited. I don't know what I'm gonna be vlogging about, but I'm excited to do it, y'all. I'm just excited to really just to connect and to just enjoy time, you know, vibing with y'all. Whether it's funny, whether it's sad, whether it's real life, you know what I mean? Like, just bring y'all into the keys experience, you feel me? So, you know, so, you know, it's all good. But listen, how was the dating world? Like, I, you know what I mean? Give me, let me know y'all thoughts about dating. Like, do y'all find dating these days to be hard? Like, it just seemed like, I don't feel like it's complicated or love is complicated. I feel like people make things complicated. Try to go on dates, you know what I mean? Like, call myself having a little girlfriend at one point in time, you feel what I'm saying? Like, I wouldn't even say a girlfriend. Like, we was just really talking and vibing, but um, she got the game so twisted, y'all. It was just like, and I wouldn't even say the game. She got me twisted. It was like uh, one of those things where I'm big on communication. I'm big on like, you know, we lived in two different states. So it's just like, hey, listen, I'm concerned. Like, you know, I know she works or whatever. So my thing is like, let me know you safe. I don't, we don't need to talk for hours, but you know, as long as you tell me you safe, you good, I'm cool with that. You know what I mean? Do y'all think that's asking for too much? Leave the comments below. Let me know if y'all think that's asking for too much. I just was concerned with her safety. She a female, getting off late at night, working late hours. So I just wanted to make sure that she was A-OK. -okay. But there will be days that she don't communicate or she don't text back. And for me, it's like, it's OK if you do it. 
but it's, it's bad if I do it. You feel what I'm saying? It's okay if you do it, but it's a problem if I do it. You feel what I'm saying? So, like I said, I'm big on communication, y'all. Like I said, I'm, I'm big on communication, y'all. I'm big on, you know, like... If when you try to get to know somebody, you try to build something, just building a solid foundation because I know what I do. I travel for work. I, I know the type of field that I'm in. I know it comes with a lot. So I try to make, you know, whoever I'm talking to secure, feel secure, feel confident at what we building. Don't I deserve that at the same token? I think I deserve that in return. So there was times when she was just like, you know, um, she felt like she didn't have to let me know she was good all the time. And that, that was a red flag for me. That was just like, all right, cool. I'm cool. You feel what I'm saying? Back to the drawing board. You know what I mean? Like, I don't really need to pay you no attention if you making me an option. You know what I mean? Like, if you feel like you're going to make me an option, then I don't really need to pay you no attention. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I could go about my life. I could go about my day. I could go about doing what I was doing. You feel me? So let me know y'all thoughts though. You know what I mean? I am, I do want to date, but I'm not pressed to be in a relationship. You know what I mean? Like I went on a date last week to the movies. It was cool. You know what I mean? Sure, these are good vibes. So let's see where it goes. I feel like, you know, just taking advice. Don't be so quick to rush into things and just keep options open because, you know, at the end of the day, only the strong survives. You feel me? Everybody is not built for every situation. So... I'm being patient, y'all, but it's summertime, you know what I mean? So I try to put my bid in now because cuffing season is coming soon, it's coming, approaching, and your boy ain't trying to go another year, you know what I mean? Like, without a boom. It's, 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 it gets lonely, and I'm not trying to be a thought out in these streets, you feel what I'm saying? Like, just came from the doctor, got everything checked out, you know what I mean? I'm 100% FDA government approved, you feel what I'm saying? Or before you, you know, get into things, you know what I mean? Just for me, personally, me, I want to make sure I'm good. I want to make sure I'm checked out. I want to make sure I'm healthy. You know what I mean? Like, cause ain't nobody try to do no transferring of the diseases and all of that. I don't got time for that. And I'm a freak. So I know I like to do nasty things. You know what I mean? So I got to make sure everything is clean and right. You know what I mean? Y'all see this? I'm out here enjoying this nature. Y'all see the tortoise? Look, I don't know if y'all can see that nigga. He in the water. Try to swim for his life. Oh, little tink tink. You can do it, little tink tink. But listen, this is what this is about, man. Enjoying nature, enjoying life. It's just about enjoying the little things. You feel what I'm saying? Because sometimes you, we look for the blessings within the big things, but all of the blessings really lie in the small things. You know what I mean? Don't let that go over your head. But listen, now, it's hot out here. I just wanted to come take this little nature walk. See what's up, vibe, you know what I mean? Be one with nature, and um, I'll be back with y'all. Ten seconds later. So y'all see what's down there? It can nothing good be down there, bro. It's like a disaster waiting to happen, I'm telling you. You land in those waters, it's going to be crazy for you. But I love nature, y'all. I just don't like when nature try to attack you. You feel what I'm saying? Like, be crazy. Like crazy ass mosquitoes, be crazy, you know what I mean? But that sound was crazy, where it was like cougars and lions and all types of stuff. I ain't ready for that part of nature, y'all. <laughs> I'm not ready for that part of nature, but look. But I'm heading back to the car, y'all. That was enough nature for me, I'm cool. I'm a city boy, I'm still trying to adapt to this country life. And uh, I'm gonna vlog with y'all. I'm going to vlog with y'all when I take that trip back to New York to go see my family. I'm going to make that happen soon, y'all. So, yeah. What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? So, yeah, listen, I'm about to end this vlog at the end of the day. It's been a good, nice, productive day. Had my doctor's visit. I stopped by the crib to check jazz. Everybody was out. Um, I mean, got, got a chance. I ain't really get a chance to vlog at the crib, but... Got a chance to save it up, dab it up real quick. You know, it was Amar birthday, so make sure y'all go show my boy Amar some love. It's his birthday this weekend, so you already know how the FOE team do when we pull up. We turn up heavy, heavy, heavy. So got a lot of weekend festivities. Of course, we're still working and all of that, you know what I mean? But a lot of weekend festivities. I got rehearsal tonight, so I'm just preparing my mind for this rehearsal. Because these rehearsals be long sometimes, y'all. You know what I mean? And sometimes Friday night, you want to chill. Actually, tonight, 
I am, I think I'm planning, I think I want to go see The Little Mermaid. You know what I mean? Like, listen, don't judge me. Don't judge me. Like I said, I love Ariel. Y'all saw I got the toy. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm going to go to McDonald's and get some more toys. Actually, I'm going to go get a collection because I love Little Mermaid that much. You feel what I'm saying? So, I'm going to try to go out there, um, see what the vibes is. You feel what I'm saying? Like, see if I can catch that movie tonight because I heard it was fire. Spoke to Jazz today. I was like, yo, twin, I'm going to see Little Mermaid. You feel what I'm saying? I was like, don't judge me. So, her and Crystal went to go see it. They actually went to go see a 4D one. She was like, um, you get wet and all of that with the 4D experience. So, like, right now, I just came to check my peoples and whatnot. You know what I mean? Like, on the other side of town, before rehearsal, y'all see there's a nice little vibe over here. Got the little palm trees. Got the little pool. So, I'll probably go by the pool. You know what I mean? I'll probably go by the pool, get a little breeze or... See what's up, cause it's hotter. It's hotter than bacon grease out here, y'all. Like it's it's caliente, mucho caliente. If you know what that means, it's hot, hot, it's hot, hot as hell. Thank y'all. You know what I mean. End of this vlog, y'all. So y'all already know what to do. Stay tuned, and your boy gonna be back day two. Bye. Have a great time.